This is my One Up USA Quick Rack Single. And it's awesome, but there is one issue with it currently. It's only a single rack. I can only use one bike with this thing. But what's really cool is the fact that it's really easy to add on more. We're gonna double up our bike capacity. Stay tuned, let's get into it. All right, let's open this thing up and see what comes in the box when you get it from uh, One Up USA. Packing list, which you don't need to see. Little uh, packaging, don't need that. Probably some tools and the extra piece itself. All right, let's uh, get this out of the box. All right, inside the packaging here, we have something really hard to open. Come on. All right, after I just flung these bolts halfway across the garage, we also have the instructions on how to install this. Let's get to it. First off, what we're gonna wanna do is actually fold this open so we can install it a little bit easier. Truth be told, I don't remember how to do this. There we go, this goes like this. this now we can that's right pull down the blue levers and then you can open it up next up what we're going to want to do is remove these plastic caps all right and now simple enough we have these bolts we're going to thread them into the existing rack so it has something to grab onto I'm not gonna go super far, just so I make sure I have enough room. And next up, we're going to put this on, just like so, and slide it over. As a key, they just slide into these holes and move over, and now we can tighten them. All right, so now to tighten this down, you need to have your security wrench here. This is the wrench that I'm talking about. And this just comes in. Pro tip would be tighten it down as much as you can for actually needing to use that wrench because it does take forever if you don't. Now, they don't make this easy to tighten, that's for sure. And we do the same thing on the other side. Once you do get this on here, you do want to push down these blue levers to lock in the rack so it doesn't go left or right anymore. Well, and before I give my final thoughts on the rack, here's a quick message from today's sponsor, Upcycle. Revolutionize the way you think about your bike. Say hello to the sponsor of this video, Upcycle, your go-to peer-to-peer bike rental platform. Do you have a bike just collecting dust in your garage? It's time to turn that unused asset into cold, hard cash. With Upcycle, you can easily list your bike for rent so others can experience the joy of riding it. Upcycle handles the payments, markets your bike to potential renters, and verifies the identity of all renters to ensure a secure and trustworthy experience for everyone. Upcycle handles the payments, markets your bike to potential renters, and verifies the identity of all renters to ensure a secure and trustworthy experience for everyone. The best part is that Upcycle offers up to a $5,000 protection against theft so you can rent your bike worry-free. So why let your bike gather dust? Join the bike sharing revolution with Upcycle today. List, rent, and ride, it's all that simple. All right, so I got the add-on rack installed and it was really easy. It's literally only two bolts. I mean, it takes less than 10 minutes to install this one. Now, ideally, I do want to pick up a third rack because, you know, family. Dad, I have lots of bikes I need to bring on trips. Now let's talk about my thoughts on the rack as a whole. All right, so I've had the rack for a year now and I really like this rack. It's built very well. It, it, I've had no issues with it. I can highly recommend it. This is not sponsored or anything like that. They're not cheap, but 
they're really high quality. Well, if you found this video helpful, make sure you hit that like button and consider subscribing if you wanna see more content. And while you're at it, you should check out the original install video right here.